Welcome everyone, this is Joy of Joy Morris Beauty and in this video I'll be sharing my six month sister lock update, so stay tuned. So I know we thought, or at least I thought, that we'd never get here, but I am at the point where I have had sister locks for six months. I feel like I deserve a round of applause for that. I've had about 3 million hairstyles for my entire adult life and the fact that I have had the same hairstyle for 6 months makes me feel pretty good about myself. <laughs> so um, a little bit about my hair. If you've been watching my monthly updates so far, um, you know that I have shared some of the good as well as some of the not so good things that I have gone through since I um, had sister locks installed in my hair in January of 2021. So um, here we are at six months and um, again if you've been watching my videos you can see how much my hair has grown. Um, it was so short at first. Um, it's nothing wrong with short hair but it just was. It just was what it was and it is what it is. So my hair in the front was so short. Um, these pieces in particular that my hair would just stick like kind of stick straight up but now to see um you know my hair really starting to blossom and grow makes me so excited so um one of the coolest things about having sister locks is i feel like it's given my hair the opportunity to just kind of um rest and rejuvenate itself so i even noticed that my hairline um is kind of growing in or growing back in because i used to have a hairline that was a lot fuller than than what it is now so um, I've got some of my hair on my hairline that is growing in a bit more, which is great. And um, I noticed that a lot of my locks are actually starting to hang straight down as opposed to um, sticking out, which is what it's been for a while. Um, I have enough hair to cover my ear which is new for me because um, I didn't have that much hair to begin with. You could barely kind of see it from behind my head, but my entire ear can be covered by my hair, which is really, really cool. Um, and then I have just this, this almost, dare I say, bob action in the back. So it's just really grown out really, really nicely. Um, if you look at the crown of my head, and let me make it a little brighter for you. If you look at the crown of my head, you can see that I have some, um, and I can't figure out if they're silver or gray. I think they're silver streaks of hair, um, strands of hair in the crown of my head. I have actually had um, some of this hair since I was a small child. I've had gray slash silver hair uh, my entire life, just in the crown a little bit. And as I get a little older, I see um, more and more, I see a lot more of the hair just kind of coming into my crown area. But you can see um, my locks, some of them are starting to um, just really contract down and become very compact. Um, other ones are just still a little bit frizzy, especially towards um, the top crown section where um, my hair type is a little bit looser. You can see um, the difference, but but all in all, despite all of those differences, um, I couldn't be any more pleased with my hair than what I am. I am very happy I made the choice that I did instead of going back to relaxers ugh, or going back to crochet hair, which I was so sick of, um, or dare I say even trying wigs because, you know, first of all, my head is too big <laughs> for that. I probably have to get a custom wig. Um, to fit my head and then I probably wouldn't wear it because I get hot really easily um, So natural hair is pretty much the the way for me to go but um, I struggled to take care of my natural hair when I was natural and it was really frustrating to me um, To have loose natural hair. So to be able to have my hair in all of these little small or tiny micro locks um, and just to be able to literally like spray my hair with a light moisturizing spray and run out the door in the morning, it's the best thing ever. I've talked a lot about um, what I plan to do with my hair once it does mature. 
um will i color it you know i don't know i don't even want to think about any of those things right now i think i just kind of want to focus on the consistency of my very minimalistic hair routine and just letting my hair grow and letting it do its thing uh, my hair has been through a lot of trauma um previously if you've seen some of my other hair ch videos on my channel you know that my hair fell out after a bad relaxer experience and we also moved to dallas in january of 2020 so literally um all of this hair that you see right here is basically the hair that i've grown since we've been in dallas this is like all dallas hair <laughs> so at this point that's um what over 18 months worth of of hair growth so i should have more over nine uh, sorry more than nine inches of natural hair right now but obviously um with my hair being tightly coiled and with it being locked interlocked you don't um, see the true length the other thing about sister locks that a lot of people may not know is that they tend to shrink a little bit so when my hair is freshly washed um you can see it'll it'll hang down a little bit more but after a couple days um you know that natural curl pattern takes over and it starts to shrink up a little bit now i don't know when um if that is the same thing that women experience who have mature locks mature sister locks that they still shrink the same um, I have heard some talk of shrinkage here or there, but I don't hear people talk about it that much. Um, so we'll have to see. I'm not exactly sure. But um, those are kind of like minor details for me because I feel as though as long as you're taking care of your hair and it's healthy, it'll keep growing. You'll eventually see the length that you want to see. So you just, you know, I'm going to just leave well enough alone, at least for now, and just kind of let it grow and focus on the progress that I do have instead of comparing my locks to someone else's locks because that's just a bad path to go down. You know, you, we, we all have our own journeys in life, so I have to fo fo focus on the journey that is my own hair. So having said that, I am elated. I am excited. Um, this has been a wonderful decision for me. I feel really, really good about my hair. Um, and, and this has been great. So if anybody else is out there, thinking about getting sister locks and you're on the fence i say just just jump in the water <laughs> the temperature's just fine just jump in the water and come on um i think you'll be glad that you did it so thanks so much and if you have any questions make sure to leave them in the comments below take care